What's up guys, how you doing? Spencer here, back with another video. Happy New Year and uh, happy holidays to all you people. 2022 is finally here. Man, what a crazy year it's been. I know I've posted a couple videos, but not as many as I would have liked. So that is gonna be one of my New Year's resolutions is to post more and uh, get more content out for you guys. Starting today, January 2nd, 2022, here on the channel. Got another guitar video for you. Fantastic song, Trace Atkins. You're gonna miss this. Now for this one, I have my guitar tuned down a half step, so I'm putting this on capo two. But for you guys, it's gonna be capo one. Cause you're, I'm assuming that it's just uh, standard tuning is here. So capo one for this song. So the chords you're gonna need are G. Scooch up here a little bit, you see that better. G, C add nine, D major, E minor seven, regular E minor, regular C or C major, and A minor. So about five or six, you know, chords, nothing crazy. So this is a intermediate-ish guitar. And actually, if you look up my name on YouTube, Spencer Eisenhower, beginner guitar lesson, you will see all these chords in detail. I'll show you how to play them. I'll just give you a rough overview. C, you're gonna lock in the two bottom strings. Hold up, pause the video. Uh, when I was explaining the chords, I said C instead of a G for the first one. It is a G major, fifth and sixth, locking the two bottom strings. My bad, enjoy the rest of the video. Fifth and six. Same thing with C at nine. Lock into bottom. Slide that fifth and six down to the fourth and fifth. C major. Fourth, fifth, first, second string. D major. D major is going to be this shape right here. Like I said, <laughs> I'll go into more detail in my other video. I don't want to spend the whole video doing that. And also, too, with the D major, we're going to embellish that with the pinky finger or fourth finger on that, uh, that G string there, or the high E going to the G. Uh, e minor 7, you're going to keep the two bottom locked again and just push the fourth and fifth. I usually just use one finger because my fingers are larger than usual <laughs> and most. Regular E minor. And then A minor. It's gonna be the third and fourth, and the first string, or second string, first fret. All right, so those are all the chords. Now, the intro to the song is gonna start on the G. So what I'm doing there is I'm starting on the G and then as soon as I play the first like down strum on that, I'll show you the strum pattern in just a sec. I'm going to that C add nine with that D string. Scooch over here, show you the strum, strumming pattern. Jeez. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. And for that embellishment, really, I'm just kind of using my finger just to just up strums and not really going. So, I mean, however you want to do it, it's fine, but you know, that's, that's kind of the way I found easier. It kind of looks, you know, different too. Um, just up and down, really, up, down. And use your gauge on your volume too, because I kind of start off with that fade in. You know, 
So use your gauge on that. Not a hard strumming pattern at all. Now the verse, first verse I'm gonna play through for you and uh, I'll show you what I'm doing in a sec. Start on the C at nine. She was sitting in the back seat SUV complaining saying I can't wait to turn 18 she said I'll make my own money and I'll make my own rules mama put the car in the park out there in front of school and then she kissed her head and said I was just like you that's the first verse for you right there. So what you're gonna do is you're just going, <coughs> she was starting the C at nine. Sitting in the back seat of that SUV. So C to G. Sitting in the back seat of that SUV. And go to the minor after the C at nine. Complain saying, I can't wait. And this is the E minor seven. I can't wait to turn 18. Complain, complain, say, I can't wait to turn 18. Back to the C at nine. She says, I'll make my own money. And I'll make my own rules. Mama put the car in the park. I'll be Park, go to this E minor seven. Park out there in front of the school. A minor, then she kissed her head. Says I was just like you. So when we go to and she kissed her head. It's the A minor. Going to the C, the regular C major chord. Said I was just like you. Then it's D. No embellishment on this either. Kissed her head, said I was just like you. And then we go to the uh, chorus. I'll play through that and I'll show you what I'm doing. You're gonna miss this. You're gonna want this back. You're gonna wish these days hadn't gone by so fast. Oh, these are some good times. So take a good look. So after the first uh, chorus there, you just go back to the intro of the... Remember that embellishment. So for the chorus, just starting on that G. You're gonna miss this. You're gonna want... T major. Want this back. A minor. You're gonna wish these days. C major hadn't gone by so deep fast. Oh, these are some good times. Back to the G. So take a good look around. And on that second part there, you're not going to stay on the G for those um, those two bars. There, you're just going to do it for two counts instead of four count. Look around. You may E minor, the regular, not the not the. Uh, not E minor 7, just a regular E minor. You may not know it now. E minor D to C at 9. Back to the G. You won't miss this. Second verse, here we go. Before she knows it, she's a brand new bride in a one bedroom apartment and her daddy stops by. He tells her it's a nice place, and she says it'll do for now. Starts talking about baby to buy the house. And daddy shakes his head. 
says, baby, just slow down. You're going to miss this. Same thing for the second chorus and really the second verse, too. So everything's just repeated. But on that end of the, um, when it goes, Daddy shakes his head. Says, baby, just slow down. I'm kind of doing like a, kind of starting off quiet on that C. Just slow down. You know, so kind of building up to that second chorus. Because that's the other thing, too, you want to have with your songs playing guitar. You don't want to just have it monotone, like the same. You don't want to have the same intensity throughout the whole song. You kind of want to build it up a little bit, which gives it more depth. Now, after the second verse, or I'm sorry, after the second chorus, um, it kind of rings out. You're going to miss this. Hard to believe. I mean, you're gonna miss this. You're gonna want this back. You're gonna wish these days hadn't gone by so fast. So this is a good time. That's what I'm saying with that build up. It kind of gives that that crescendo. So, um,. For the bridge there, you just it's really easy, honestly. You're just gonna go to the C at nine to the G. Five years later, there's a woman working on water heaters, barking, phones are ringing, one kid's crying, one kid's screaming, and she keeps apologizing. And she says they don't bother me. I got two babies of my own, one's 36. 23. So just go to that E minor 7 to the D back to the C. Hard to believe. And then on that last chorus there, you're just gonna, if you want to do this, you can. You can just strum it like you're gonna miss this. You're gonna want this back. Or you can go like you're gonna miss this. You're gonna want this back. You're gonna So it's up to you, honestly, whatever you feel uh, for that. Uh, I kind of like the method of just kind of just strumming it out, you know, just. Miss this. You're gonna want this back. You're gonna wish these days hadn't gone by so fast. Well, this is my time. That's basically it, folks. The whole song, Trace Atkins, you're gonna miss this. Uh, very cool song to sing, kind of gets you thinking about life, so don't take it for granted. And uh, like I said, I'm going to be posting 100% way more in 2022. Uh, just like I said, been caught up with life, hopefully you understand. Uh, but I love doing these videos, honestly, I, I really do. Um, I appreciate you guys watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and turn on that bell notification so you know when I upload a new video. Because I'm going to try to do one, honestly, let's, let's shoot for every week. Um, that would be awesome. If we can get these these videos up in likes and, uh, and views, that would be super cool to know that it's helping you guys uh, reach your goals. Maybe your New Year's resolution is to learn guitar. Well, hey, I'm an intermediate player right now. Uh, I'm self-taught, going on two years, and uh, it's the greatest thing I've ever done. So I highly recommend you sticking with this channel. Like I said, if you're just starting out, Spencer Eisenhower, beginner guitar lesson, it'll show you everything you need to know. Thank you guys so much for watching. I truly appreciate it. And until next time, I'll talk to you then. Peace.